Keith Peters with the Palo Alto Weekly. And I'm Casey Burnett, a senior at the Menlo Atherton lacrosse team. Last week, uh, Casey played in uh, two uh, league lacrosse matches. She scored a total of 10 goals. She had three assists. Menlo Atherton won both matches. Then on Saturday, uh, Casey and her teammates played in the Western States Invitational. Menlo Atherton went 3-1-1. They reached the championship match for the first time in school history. Casey scored 11 goals. She had four assists. And uh, for that performance, she is the Palo Alto Weekly Girls Athlete of the Week. Uh, obviously, the big um, competition was the Western States. You'd played in it uh, for a number of years before, and uh, the getting to the championship match, um, you tied Sacred uh, St. Francis Sacramento in the uh, in the final match. That forced uh, essentially a tiebreaker called a Braveheart. Explain a little bit about what happened then. Um, well, a Braveheart is essentially a 1v1 with goalies. Um, each team sends out one of their players, and um, the team chose me to send out. So um, you take a draw at the center, and it's a full field, uh, 1v1 basically. So that was, um, it's pretty intense, and um, to have the whole team like hopes riding on you but um it was uh it was a good experience it was tough to play in the finals though <laughs> how long were you it was just you against another player you had a goalie each team had a goalie and uh, how long did you have to chase the other player and she chase you <laughs> um well brave hearts are only supposed to last for about 30 seconds but this one lasted for like five minutes it was a it was a very very long one so it was unfortunate but kept fighting so what was the best experience that you had uh, uh, during the the tournament I guess just getting to the finals and and beating I guess you beat uh, all the teams you beat were ranked ahead of you other than just one team I guess yeah um, well we didn't know that before going into it so we went into each game kind of looking objectively at the team and what we had to do and um, so from there we kind of took it one game at a time so that was really impressive and I um, all my teammates did really, really well, so I'm very proud that we got to the finals. How did you get started playing lacrosse? Um, I started freshman year, so this is my fourth year playing. Um, and my mom played it in high school, and so she encouraged me to start. Um, but I just tried out for the team, and I loved it, and so I kept playing. Menlo Atherton uh, currently is in uh, second place in the West Bay Athletic League. Uh, your only loss was to uh, defending champion Menlo. Uh, you have one more match, league match against Menlo this season, and the goal is to get to the West Bay Athletic League playoffs and uh, beat Menlo again. So what's, what's the outlook the rest of the way? Can you uh, beat them again and uh, maybe get them in the playoffs? Um, well, we have a really strong team this year, um, and each player on the team is really talented, and it really comes down to if we can come together as a team and execute what we practice. So I definitely believe that we can um, win the championship this year, so I'm excited to see what happens. Well, good luck the rest of the way. Congratulations. Thank you.